Hi guys, Marcus here and welcome to Chinese Entertainment Update September 25th, 2019 edition. Make sure to watch till the end where for your convenience, I do a recap of all the dramas that have premiere dates. In this edition, I'll present to you my top 10 highly anticipated Chinese costume dramas. But first, a reminder that Lucky's First Love starring Xing Chaoling and Bai Lu premiered today on iQIYI. There should be 4 episodes by the time this video is uploaded. Here are some of their latest promo pics. A dating app designer played by Bai Lu decides to do some research and goes on a series of real-life dates. But how does her jealous boss, played by Xing Chaoling, react to it when he's been using her as a personal lucky charm? iQIYI releases two episodes every Wednesday through Friday, beginning today. VIP members get the entire series immediately. I will update if and when it comes to YouTube officially. And before we get to the main event, here's a quick rundown of some dramas that have premiere dates. Spike is a youth sports drama starring Zhu Ziling and Rainbow Xu. It is a Chinese remake of the Thai drama Project S, the series Spike. The drama premiered on September 24th and is available on Tencent. My Girlfriend is a romance drama starring Timmy Xu and Chiao Xing and is based on a novel of the same name. The drama has announced an October 8th premiere and will be available on Youku. And The Glorious Era, a Republican-era drama starring Zhang Yi and Pan Ziling. It has announced an October 13th premiere and will be available on Tencent and iQIYI. These days, we're seeing so many patriotic dramas premiere, and that's fine. It's the 100 days of broadcasting period, and it's expected. But I am a costume drama fan, and I can't help but talk about costume dramas, even though at this time there isn't much happening in terms of them premiering. So I was thinking about highly anticipated costume dramas, and I came up with about 30 of them and narrowed it down to 10. Now, these are costume dramas that have completed shooting and are just awaiting an official release date. So, for example, Ashes of Love 2, still in top hasn't started shooting, doesn't count. The Legend of Fei with Cao Liying and Wang Yipo, still shooting, hasn't wrapped yet, doesn't count. And Princess Agents 2, not even in the works, doesn't count. So we're only talking about the ones that have completed shooting, is in the can, and going through post-production, or awaiting an official release date. Here are my top 10 highly anticipated Chinese costume dramas. Number 10, Zhao Ge. Zhao Ge stars Zhang Zihan and Wu Jingyan and tells the story of a prince who is held hostage in the city of Zhao Ge and his journey to becoming a legendary ruler. The drama is slated for 50 episodes and wrapped filming in February 2017. Number 9, Handsome Siblings. Handsome Siblings stars Hu Yitian and Chen Ziyuan and tells the story of two supreme martial artists who are twins separated at birth. They are raised to take revenge on each other but find themselves becoming good friends. The drama is slated for 53 episodes and wrapped filming in July 2018. Number 8, Win the World. Win the World stars Fan Bingbing and Gavin Gao and chronicles the life of Ba Qing, the wealthiest woman in the Qin Dynasty who funded the building of the Great Wall of China. The drama is slated for 66 episodes and wrapped filming in July 2017. Now we all know about the controversy surrounding the lead actors, which means the drama might not even see the light of day. Personally, I think it will, eventually. Gavin Gao's case is not concluded yet, but Fan Bingbing's tax scandal seems to be slowly blowing away. Whether they reshoot Gavin's scenes or just release the drama overseas, I think there's too much money invested in it for them to just forget about it. As to when it will be released, anybody's guess is as good as mine. Number 7, Legend of Awakening. Legend of Awakening stars Arthur Chen and Dylan Xiong and tells the story of four young heroes who begin their journeys towards awakening as they protect their people against ravaging beasts. The drama is slated for 50 episodes and wrapped filming in January 2019. Number 6, The Fated General. The Fated General stars Zhang Ruoyun and Rachel Mao and chronicles the life of Huo Qiping, a young general in the Han Dynasty from his humble beginnings to his military victories. The drama is slated for 92 episodes, pretty sure that will change, and wrapped filming in November 2017. Number 5, And the Winner is Love. And the Winner is Love stars Liu Luo and Yuki Chen and tells the story of two martial arts masters who track down the stolen martial arts manual, Nine Techniques of the Lotus God. The drama is slated for 50 episodes and wrapped filming in September 2019. 
Number 4, The Pillow Book. The Pillow Book stars Del Raba and Van Gogh Gao and depicts the 2000 year love story between Bai Fengjiu and Donghua Dijun. The drama is slated for 60 episodes and wrapped filming in November 2018. I know many of you would put this drama much higher than number 4, and rightly so if fantasy romance is your favorite cup of tea. Personally, I like my dramas with more action, and this doesn't strike me as one that will have much of that. Still looking forward to it though. Number 3, The Wolf. The Wolf stars Darren Wang, Li Qing, and Xiao Zhan, and tells the story of a prince who grew up in the mountains and the daughter of a governor and how they fight for justice together. The drama is slated for 58 episodes and wrapped filming in September 2017. This is one of the most asked about dramas on my channel, and it's been asked about even more since Xiao Chan's breakthrough in The Untamed. Unfortunately, there is no word of a release date yet, but rest assured I'll update when they announce something. Number 2, Evernight 2. Evernight 2 stars Dylan Wang and Sung Yiren and tells the story of a young general who protects his maidservant whose connection to the Eternal Night has been exposed. The drama is slated for 60 episodes and wrapped filming in May 2019. Much was made of Dylan Wang replacing Arthur Chen, since Arthur did such a terrific job in season 1. Dylan looks great in the production stills, so I think the general consensus now is, let's wait and see how it turns out before we judge, which I think is fair. And number 1, Sword Dynasty. Sword Dynasty stars Li Xian and Li Yitong and tells the story of a sword cultivator with vengeance on his mind as he sets out to overthrow the tyrannical kingdom of Wu ruled by sorcerers. The drama is slated for 40 episodes and wrapped filming in April 2018. Revenge assassination wuxia dramas are my favorite so Sword Dynasty takes the cake for me. Feng Xiaogang whose works I enjoy is an executive producer on this drama, another reason why I'm excited for it. There's also a kick-ass teaser of it that you guys can check out on YouTube. So there you have it guys, my top 10 highly anticipated Chinese costume dramas. What's your most highly anticipated Chinese costume drama? Let us know in the comments section below. And before I let you guys go, here's a quick recap of all the dramas that have premiere dates. Lucky's First Love premiered on September 25th. Spiked premiered on September 24th. My Girlfriend will premiere on October 8th. And The Glorious Era will premiere on October 13th. And that's it for today guys, do check out my Patreon page where you can find perks to being a patron, the link is in the description box below. This show would not be possible without your support, whether it's through Patreon or simply by watching, liking, and subscribing. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you all in the next one. Cheers!